You burning your mouth? Yum. Yeah. Look at the bread. Oh my god, I'm excited for that. <laughs> That's the best part. It is. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta do it, girl. You gotta get in there. You just cut it. Are you, you gonna have, it. Are you gonna have half of this? Have some bread. <laughs> oh my god, this is, I just had the bread. That's delicious. Yep. I don't know, you might not want to share this. <laughs> Got it, Ken. Yes! First experience. Oh my god. Two sandwiches. Yeah, oh my god. Very exciting. Oh, uh, girl, go for it. I'm so nom 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 nom. Is this supposed to look like this? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Can I roast people? Roast people. Where's my church, okay? Yeah. Chop, <laughs> slow down. Here. Oh my god, this is sopping. Yeah. Okay. I, know, I just made up a word, I think. <laughs> That's what happens. This is sopping. Okay, I'm ready. Alright. Holy shit. Oh it's all about the broth, man. Oh my god. Why oh, you show me the spot? Let's do that. <laughs> Can I get an extra plate for you, Ken? Thank you. This is delicious. I just said broccoli. So the kids are in the back playing. Yeah. The adults in the front. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Okay. That's what's happening. Okay, I'm coming. Having some fun today on this Sunday afternoon. I'm actually going to do a podcast. And there's the camera. And if you look, I'm in it. Double vlog. <laughs> Are you excited, Mike? Yeah. You excited? Yeah. All right. Very exciting. We're just waiting. I like this. But that's the photographer in me. I really like that. So, need one of those, right? <laughs> Ooh, behind Wait, the scenes. No, you want the video game cup? Yeah, you need one video game cup. Actually, we're gonna both have black mugs. Okay. We're gonna keep it. It's uh, so all profesh. Yeah. Oh my god! Put Does that look familiar, guys? This stuff in front okay. of my television. <laughs> Fun, fun, fun. Oh, yeah. And then you run a test before you just start recording, okay? What's that for a test? I know. You don't want your dogs trolling. I just want to know how much time I have left to be friends with you because I know everybody sat in this chair. Hey, guys. Welcome. It is Tuesday, the 11th of April, I believe. And. It is 60 degrees out today in Long Island here. Um, it's gorgeous. The sun, there's not a cloud in the sky. It's beautiful out. So it's really nice to have, you know, a couple of days in a row now. It's been like this. And, you know, we all need that vitamin D from the sun. And we, just the sun makes us happy and uh, makes you want to go out more and not go to work <laughs> or not stay indoors, you know. Um, I'm heading over to my doctor now, my cardiologist. This is another process uh, in uh, going forward with the bariatric surgery. Oh, I'm sorry, the sleeve. Having the sleeve surgery done. So I have to go to a cardiologist. So that's what we're doing today. Um, I had an EKG done, I think at the beginning of the year, and it came out okay. But I'm not sure what other things that they need to do. Um, pertaining to what needs to be done for the bariatric surgeon, uh, what he needs and such like that. So uh, that's what I'm doing so far today. And then on Saturday, there I see a pulmonist. And they have to check my lungs and all that because um, well, obviously when they do the surgery, they have to be 
put under and I'm guessing with the anesthesia and all that they want to make sure that your lungs are okay and able to withstand all that so that's what's going on right now and then I don't know what's going on today but hopefully something fun <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're playing the drums. Yeah. <laughs> if anybody watches Impractical Jokers in the first season, second season, this is the White Castle they were in. Go. Does anybody remember? Welcome to the Castle of White. So I went to the doctor today, I went to see the cardiologist and he's not concerned with me at all. I, I had an EKG done in November and then I saw him two years ago and he says it's exactly the same and you're healthy so don't worry. So that's good but because uh, things need to be checked and they need proof, the bariatric group, so um, he's going to do a heart monitor for me I think tomorrow for 24 hours. And then there's an ultrasound on my heart going to be done um, the beginning of next month. And once all that is said and done, he'll send over the information to the group and that's it for that. And again, I have to see the pulmonist later on in the week, then get an, um, an endoscopy. So I think after that, I have done it all. Been crazy ride. So between my back, which I haven't told you guys much about that, but uh, I've been getting uh, shots in the back, uh, point uh, trigger point injection shots. So they kind of help a little bit. But still, if I walk a little bit and I get pain, I still get pain, but not the same level of pain as I was getting because that was like level nine, ten pain. This is about a five. So I cut it in half, and sitting is a little easier depending which chair. Crazy stuff people crazy stuff going on. So I got like doctors for my back and then trying to get this stuff for the bariatric doctor Trying to live life trying. <laughs> uh, I complain a lot, but I don't really mean to I'm just in pain. I'm cranky and Got a lot on my mind, you know, this is, this is a big step and there's a lot to do before the surgery, and the surgery will help my back. We have family coming from Sicily soon. Uh, they're coming in tomorrow, actually, tomorrow morning, so I get to see them for a little while. So that'll be nice. And what else? Then uh, I have a friend coming over. She's going to help me do the things I can't do in the house, which... Uh, a lot of cleaning and organizing so very thankful for that because uh, <laughs> I need help <laughs> I need like serious help with the house and she's good with organizing she said so maybe I could get things in control and I can like purge things maybe she'll see things that I don't really need which I'm holding on to for God knows what so that's good help and then the weekend is coming and I'm planning something for next month. So I'm gonna work on that this weekend. And of course, Easter is coming. So that should be good. Uh, spend some time with my family for Easter. I don't get to see them very often. And uh, my aunt, uh, my mother's sister, she's Jewish. And I haven't been able to celebrate any Jewish holidays with actual Jewish family because I don't have any really here. And my mom's sister and her family lived on the West Coast. So being that my aunt is here, we're going to put together some matzo meal pancakes and have some chicken from uh, Boston Market because it's just easier than cooking it. And so we'll have a little Jewish and have a little Boston Market. <laughs> But it's just good to celebrate the holidays. 
with family. So hopefully you guys are doing something fun with your family during this Passover week if you're Jewish and then if you're Christian, uh, Sunday. <laughs> so I'm heading over to a friend's house to have some dinner. And I will see you guys later.